God is inviting you for one last time this month. Because after this, you will not get any further chance to repent of your sins that you have committed mistakenly or intentionally this month. He is saying, My child, hear my voice as I speak to you right now. This is not a coincidence nor a random message. This is the last invitation I am extending to you this month. I have been calling out to you, urging you to come closer to me, to let go of your sins and to accept my love and mercy. But you have been ignoring my voice, turning a deep ear to my pleas and allowing the world to pull you away from me. But today, I am giving you one last chance, one final opportunity to answer my call. I invite you to come to me, lay down your burdens and sins, and receive my grace and forgiveness. This is not a call to judgment or condemnation, but a call to salvation and redemption. I want to save you from the darkness that is consuming your soul, heal you from the wounds hurting your heart, and restore you to the purpose and destiny that I have planned for you. Do not try to escape this invitation, my child, for this is your moment of truth, your turning point your crossroad. You cannot afford to miss it, to delay it, or to reject it. If you do, you will face the consequences of your choices. The weight of your sins and the judgment of your dates. But if you accept my invitation, surrender your life to me and trust in my promises, you will experience the fullness of my love, the power of my grace and the joy of my salvation. As the psalmist said, today, if you hear his voice, do not harden your hearts. Today is the day of salvation, the day of repentance, the day of transformation. Do not wait for another day, another moment, another opportunity. For this is the last invitation I am extending to you this month. I am reaching out to you with all the love, mercy, and compassion of my heart. Tell me now, will you come to me? Type, yes God, if you are willing to do so. Welcome back to Lord Help's Ministry. Today, through the guiding power of the Holy Spirit, God has called you here to repent of the sins that you have done intentionally or mistakenly in the month of April. Know that life is unpredictable and can change in an instant. It's crucial to take advantage of the opportunities that God presents us with specially when it comes to our spiritual well-being. As human beings, 
we often make mistakes and fall short of our own standards let alone the standards of a perfect and holy god it's easy to get caught up in our own lives and forget about our relationship with him we can become complacent in our faith thinking that we can always repent later and that god will always be there for us but the truth is we don't know how much time we have left on this earth this is why god is inviting us for one last time this month not to scare us but to remind us that we need to be diligent in our faith and make it a priority we cannot afford to take a relationship with him for granted we need to take this last invitation seriously and make the most of it it's easy to let our busy lives distract us from what's truly important but we need to remember that our relationship with god is the most important thing we have It's what gives us purpose and direction in life. Without it, we are lost and wandering aimlessly. So, my dear friends, let's not try to escape this last invitation from God. Let's embrace this with open hearts and minds and take this opportunity to draw closer to him. Let's take the time to reflect on Let us take the time to reflect on our lives and repent of our sins and seek his forgiveness. Remember, God loves us unconditionally and wants nothing more than for us to have a fulfilling and meaningful relationship with him. He is not trying to scare us or make us feel guilty. of his never ending grace and mercy let us use it as a chance to deepen our faith and grow closer to him who knows this could be the moment that changes our lives forever so let us repent now through this prayer my loving heavenly father i come to you today with a heavy heart acknowledging that I have sinned against you in my thoughts, words, and deeds. I have not always lived my life in a way that pleases you, and I have made mistakes that have hurt myself and others. I am truly sorry for my sins, and I ask for your forgiveness. Please help me to turn away from my sinful ways and to follow your will for my life. Fill me with your holy spirit so that I may be strengthened to resist temptation and to do what is right in your eyes. Thank you for your unconditional love and mercy. Thank you for sending your son Jesus Christ to sacrifice his life for my sins on the cross so that I may have eternal life with you. I commit my life to you today and I ask that you guide me every step of the way. Please help me to grow closer to you each day and to live a life that honors you. In Jesus' holy and precious name I pray. Amen.